Hey there, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I want to show you how to quickly and easily create a Mac OS Sierra bootable USB flash drive. It's absolutely essential to have your Mac OS on a bootable USB flash drive just in case you might need it later to recover or restore your operating system. Now, the two things you need as a prerequisite for this procedure is a USB flash drive with a minimum of 8 gigabytes of capacity and a downloaded version of the Mac OS Sierra. I'm assuming you already have a USB flash drive, so let me show you how to download Mac OS Sierra, which is very easy. So let's dive in and tackle the whole process step by step. Alright, so to download Mac OS Sierra, all you have to do is go to the App Store. So let's go to the App Store together and start the procedure. Uh, so launch App Store and search for Sierra or Mac OS Sierra. And then just click on the uh, suggestion, go into the utility, and all you have to do is simply click download. And the download process might take 20-25 minutes depending on your connection. So that's step number one. So once you download Mac OS Sierra, it simply goes into your applications folder. So let me just show you that really quickly so you know what you're working with over here. So just launch Finder, go into the applications folder, and if you scroll down, uh, you'll see install Mac OS Sierra. So basically all we're gonna do is we're gonna take this uh, folder over here and we're gonna dump this, transfer this into the USB flash drive properly. Now before we can do that, we have to format the USB flash drive the correct way. So let's finish that step. And then as, as a final step, I'm gonna show you how to transfer this file to the USB flash drive and then we're done. All right, so next step, make sure you guys insert the USB flash drive into the USB port of your Mac computer. And once you do that, it's gonna show up over here on the desktop. Mine says Untitled, it's a brand new USB flash drive. So it doesn't have a name yet. So yours might have a name, but you're gonna know that you just plugged into it and it's gonna show up on your desktop. So the next step is to go to the applications, scroll down, go to utilities, and then launch disk utility. So on the disk utility, you will see the media that you just plugged in the USB flash drive. It's gonna be on the left-hand side under external. So mine says media. So all you have to do is select media and then click erase over here on the top. And of course, I highly recommend that you rename this to Mac OS Sierra install or something that makes sense to you. And for format, choose Mac OS Extended Journaled. And for the scheme, you can leave it as Master Boot Record. And then click Erase. And that's gonna be a very quick process. It's gonna reformat the, uh, the drive into something usable for our purpose. Once the procedure is complete, you'll get this same message over here. It's gonna say Erasing Media and Creating Mac OS Sierra Install is complete. You'll see the green check mark. Uh, you can click done and as you can see everywhere the name has changed so the usb flash drive is now ready to rock but remember as a final step we still have to take that file that we just downloaded from the app store for the mac os sierra installation take that entire folder and transfer it to this usb flash drive we just prepared so let's do that procedure and then we're really done all right, so we're finally at the final step, so let's complete the process. But just to make your life easier, I'm gonna make one final modification. Uh, go to Applications, go to Utilities, and relaunch Disk Utility. And just go back to that uh, USB flash drive we just formatted. I just want you guys to rename this to one single word, okay? These spaces could be uh, trouble. So let's rename this to Sierra Install. Okay, so that's much better. So make sure uh, it's all case sensitive, okay? So let's click okay. So that's been renamed. And then get out of here, go back into applications, scroll down, go to utilities and launch terminal. Now on the terminal, all we're gonna do is we're gonna copy and paste a very simple command. Now that command, you're gonna be able to find that in the description below. But over here, I have it in a text file right here. All right, just to be clear, this block of text here that you're gonna copy and paste over here into the terminal is going to be in the description below. Just copy and paste it from there instead of this text file that you don't have access to. Now, the one thing I just wanna make sure again is make sure this red text over here matches the text, the name of the actual uh, USB flash drive that we just renamed just to make it easy on us. 
So let's copy and paste this whole thing. Very simple. Come over here, right click, paste, and all you have to do is press enter. It's going to ask you to put your password in. This is the same password you put in when you log into your Mac. So type in the password and then press enter. And as you can see, that's going to start the procedure. So it's going to say erasing disk 0%, 10%, 20%. It's going to take a couple minutes and then everything is going to be square. So it's saying copying installer files to disk. And once the procedure is complete, this is what you will see. It says copy complete and done and you are done. Now you have a bootable USB flash drive with Mac OS Sierra installation. Here's the USB flash drive we just created. And I'm sure some of you guys are wondering what's the point. I'm just going to quickly show you how you can use this. So let's say that you have some kind of problem and your Mac OS is not, uh, your MacBook or your, you know, any, any kind of Mac that you have is not powering up properly. All you do is grab this USB flash drive that we just created in this video, uh, plug it into a USB port, and then press and hold option on the keyboard and then press power. And don't let the option button go. And as you can see over here, you have two options now. You can e either uh, boot into your regular hard drive, which is gonna load up your uh, operating system. And let's say you're having trouble with that. This one over here, if you swipe over, I mean, if you scroll over, it, this is the USB flash drive that's gonna allow you to reinstall or repair your operating system. So if I press enter, it's gonna launch the uh, screen that's gonna allow us to pick the options from where we can go any route that we want. So that's the screen you're gonna see. And from this screen, as you can tell by the options, you have options like install Mac OS, get help online, you can even access the disk utility if you want, or you can simply restore from a time machine backup, which I really, really hope that you guys do. But if you want to uh, install the operating system again, you can simply go to install OS, uh, click enter, and that's gonna walk you through all the necessary steps. So that is the point of having this USB flash drive just for future, just for safety.